Hello and welcome to an RPG. I am Suffering. Today we're going to be in RimWorld. I'm going to be starting a little series here. Just have a little break in between the hardcore series of Return to Moria and uh, like the next series of Return to Moria, which we will be starting just in a couple of days. I'm going to give myself the weekend and a couple of days after that to have a little bit of a break in between. And then we're going to jump straight back into Return to Moria. So don't worry about that. Today we're going to be running a little bit something different. So what we have on the RimWorld, I've got no mods. This is vanilla. I have a uh, EDB prepare carefully just to create some of the starter pawns we have over here we have uh the durins folks we created our own genes here uh they did mess around a little bit and like it's not like a playthrough it's going to be ridiculously hard or anything it is going to be like not massively easy because the settings are set to hard but there's a couple of things that i wanted to have on here like slow runner we wanted high libido and fertility great mining great crafting because the story of these guys if i can find i don't even remember how to actually find the uh here we go here so the narrative of what we're creating for this run is the in the heart of a once great dwarven kingdom a group of five skilled artisans and engineers there to challenge the rigid traditions of their ancestors fascinated by the possibilities of technology they sought to merge ancient craftsmanship with innovative machinery creating wonders that would elevate their people to new heights but their pursuits were met with fear and suspicion by the elders who saw technology as a dangerous deviation from the old ways branded as heretics and exiled from their home the five dwarves a master smith a cunning engineer a brilliant researcher a skilled medic and seasoned warrior vowed to prove the value of their vision they ventured into the uncharted territories of the rim world seeking a place to establish a new home where innovation and tradition could thrive in harmony we do have a couple of extra things here physical love is free and approved of they can just run around and because we're going to be doing uh, only a dwarf run so each of the durin's folk are only going to be able to have uh, the durin's folk in here we're not going to be accepting any other people we're not going to be uh, grabbing any uh, prisoners or anything we're just going to be running through and only breeding and having children through that way and that's the only way we can grow our colony uh we do have everything open i do have anomaly on because i haven't played anomaly like i haven't played anomaly at all but let's get let's just get into the whole let's just get into building our thing we are on a mountainous map and it did come out with this really nice little completely and utterly symmetrical entryway here which is absolutely beautiful for me and it doesn't blow my brain into a million pieces so we're going to start off by like covering up this little area here and then we're going to start digging into the mountain and start building our kingdom for technological goals we are only allowed to use two types of weapons blunt melee weapons and heavy weapons are the only things we're going to be able to be using for these dwarves and we're going to try and get some heavier armor etc etc these guys are not like massively like uh, they have randomized stuff but i wanted it to be sort of uh have each of these have exactly what we kind of need we got mining and stuff like that mining construction one guy's got a construction one guy's got electricity crafting intellectual we got the doctor etc etc so we have got everything that needs to be done we're going to go into work over here and we can have these guys all construct because they can all do that crafting etc we're not going to go in and set the priorities yet excuse me uh we're going to have this guy be our main doctor astrid's going to be our healer we have three females two males so we can have some uh, breeding going on as quickly as possible so we can start with the babies i have turned the babies up to 600 percent, so that's literally all we're going to be doing let's drop these guys out and have these guys on research two of these guys can be on research we're gonna have wait no who's got the higher research oh you actually got pretty damn high research so we'll have you up there and that's going to be a dark study we won't even do that until we get there i don't even know how that bloody works to be perfectly honest so let's uh unlock these things real quick uh let's go there press f right who has melee that's what i need to know uh you haven't got shit you've got shooting shooting and melee you've got high melee so we can give you one of the steel warhammers you've got high melee as well where's another warhammer i quit the warhammer there uh you have really bad everything to be honest your shooting's quite low but we can equip you and you can equip that where is i'm sure i had another one is it there what is that anyway that's a steel warhammer so what's that oh it's just a different angle so we'll equip you why not let's get the speed up we're not doing a no pause run because i do actually want to be able to play just to enjoy myself like doing a little bit of the hardcore and everything is kind can kind of be a little bit of a bore like sometimes to be honest just want to enjoy myself and play a little bit of Greenwell. not going to do a massive amount let's go into the zone and stick a stockpile up here we'll stick a stockpile here we don't need a dumping stockpile yet but we do want to build a wall we are pretty much going to be completely vanilla for the moment so we'll grab this across and this across here just to fill that in for the moment and we'll stick a door in there there's an ornate door what is that ah there's double doors now didn't even know that existed lovely that's three across though we have to do a single entrance damn it it's not as perfect as i thought it was uh let's go in here we're going to architect um 
it's been a while since i played so i've got to really start to remember what to do here furniture sleeping spots we are one two we need to get these guys inside asap so i, I swear i unlocked all that i did didn't i do we have everything unlocked there is some silver there why is this not unlocked ah because i keep pressing it twice that's my bad it's been a special case is that guinea pig that's a big ass guinea pig uh so yeah let's just crack on let's get up to the top there i was gonna get some of the speed up mods and stuff like that like we're gonna be doing this split and cut and all that sort of stuff but we are going to actually start to think about let's go into orders mine uh we will mine off just until maybe here and then uh how, how am i gonna do this we'll do it five and then but but and then five but but and then wait no 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 that's wrong oh we can do it anyway that's fine one two and then accidentally do that orders go into here cancel that one go to mine just two so why is it being a dick there we go and we'll just mine this little bit of an area out and we'll just have this at the start for us Let's just fill in this in real quick so i will be doing cuts all the way through it it's not going to be like uh completely uncut this guy needs to actually get in here and crack on. We do need to pick up. We have no wood. Why do we have no wood? Let's chop some of these trees out. Let's cut these bad boys down and cut some of these bad boys down. They are tunnelers. So they do have some of the things that are quite... Um, let me just pause that real quick. Go to bio. So they are in tunnelers, transhumanist and individualist. And they do have a couple of little things. We've got body, body modifications, etc. They do love their mushrooms and all that. We have changed some of these guys to four master general, rune priest for the moral guide, geotechnician for the deep rock covenant, etc. We have a rune priest, law master, geotechnician. We've got the funeral, which is deep rocking eulogy. And we've got an archic event. We've got pews and all that kind of thing. Our relics are melee weapons, melee uh, blunt weapons, because we have have ranged heavy noble and melee blunt over melee piercer and ranged light so we're going to be using heavy and that's about it the grinder over here if we eventually do get that let's just cut our way into this mountain they're going to eat their nom noms why is there no roof in this area uh zone roofing 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 because they're going to get upset with me man uh build roof area build a roof man why are you not building a roof there what did i just get can I build a roof over an oak tree? I know. That's why they're going to cut it down ASAP. Cut the tree down, man. God, they're not very good at that. They should be making beer. That, that's something that dwarves should actually have. <laughs> I completely forgot to put the beer dependency. Uh, we'll try and get them addicted to beer. We'll get them all addicted to beer eventually. Why are these? These are taking a hell of a long time to cut down these trees, man. Like a long time. Let's actually get a door in here. We'll put a dumping stockpile outside here, just in this corner. So we can actually get rid of these. I wish there was like a hall priority thing. Let's get that all hauled. I'm just keep on going until we get that all outside. Got a fallen monolith. What is this? Cogram has noticed an ancient monolith partly buried nearby. If you investigate, you can learn more. Let's jump to location. I don't know what this does, to be honest. Do we want to start it straight away? I'm not going to start it straight away and see what happens because I haven't. Seen... Why are you all the way over there, Colgrim, man? That's pretty naughty. Right. We're actually going to do this. I'm going to claim this entire thing. Oh, I actually have to go into orders to press the button. Let's. No, wrong one. Uh, where's claim? Claim's over there. Let's claim all of you and then we can break you lot down. Deconstruct all of that stuff. So we can use this, which is just limestone walls. We can use that as part of defense. It's going to break some of it down. They're going to go to sleep now, though. And we'll go in here while they're asleep. Go to structure. We're going to craft the limestone door and put you there. I don't know what we're going to do with the traps just yet. I don't know if I'm going to do it in a way. So we're going to have it like that and that. And then we can have another one in there like that. And we'll have some guns just to have a little bit of a platform to stand around. So have two melee guys holding off the doorway. If they break through the door, that's perfectly fine. We are going to actually get all this cleared off. We're going to haul of that out because I want to get that out of the way. Because we do need to actually do something that's quite important here in a momentito. What we're going to do is actually go bot, bot, five, bot, bot, five, bot, bot, five, or not. You're just gonna overpress the button. I'm gonna break that down. Let's just get all that done. And then we're gonna start planting some of our stuff in here. We're gonna move these beds inside. Yeah, there's no beds, I understand. Uh production furniture. Let's see if we can make some beds. Can we make wooden beds? Okay, indeed. One, two, three, four, five. And let's just have you in the corner up there. One of you are gonna craft all that. You've all got pretty decent crafting, so I don't see why that'd be an issue. And we can at least have the beds sorted, be a little bit more comfortable. Why did they have to be need recreation variety? Uh recreation. Let's just shark which like a horse shoe pin outside here why is there a dead ass body what's that who the hell is that that's weird but we're gonna craft that little horseshoe out there just to keep us going for the moment we are gonna dig through and we do need to get all of this 
stuff gone to be perfectly honest uh minor break risk why why do you have a minor break risk what we got hideous environment yeah we're gonna clean it up in a moment man plus we're gonna get you the food you need we will smooth the walls out of entry you are not having a good time man you are not having a good time at all eight without table disturb sleep we will put a table and stuff in here why not let's just get that all gone we're speeding through this a little bit too quickly hopefully it's not gonna like absolutely murder ourselves we are gonna be working on the technological stuff so the technological stuff is going to be really important for us where's a table there's a table there we're going to do one by two just stick you in a corner over here for the moment we will give them all individual bedrooms they're like we're going to have the whole area built out it's going to, i think it's going to be quite nice in the end minor break risk uh let's just add a dining chair spin it around but but and then spin that around there so you guys can eat why is that door taking so damn long to build man just build the damn door he's failing there we go now we have a door inside so let's get rid of this and we'll sit, we'll take the day to do this. We'll move our actually we're gonna move our zone, stop power zone inside. But first flooring, 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 flooring. I keep forgetting to do certain stuff. Let's just do the fungal gravel in here. Why the hell not? Because we're actually just gonna this is gonna be our main source of food as tunnelers. We're gonna be making our and then we can just do a grow zone on top of that. Uh I do want to build another door there. Burn not furniture, bloody hell. Losing my mind. We'll stick that in there. And we'll build the bedrooms off. It's taking them a hell of a long time to craft this stuff, to be honest. Well, that should level up their grinding a little bit anyway. What do we have going on right now? Nothing's going on. We're on a couple of days in. We're not too far in. So we shouldn't get anything that turns up and attacks us in a moment. I'm gonna like I'm gonna slow down a little bit. I'm gonna take my time. Because I'm kind of feel like I was rushing into it. Like I'm doing some like whenever I play Rimworld, I'm always just like bang, we have to get this done, we have to get this done, we have to get this done. But we, we can take our time. We're here to enjoy it. This guy is what is wrong? Ugly environment okay observed rotting court ah you know uh let's get rid of you uh build structures no we want it's not gonna be in furniture is it where is it miscellaneous grave let's just pop you down over here get out of the way everyone's going to sleep they're all sleeping together it's not really the best thing in the world to do we do have mm, wait for him to wake up we'll do some wall torch lamps let's turn you around plop you there plop you there and we'll plop some two outside here bop and bop and we'll see if it's gonna help i don't think they need that much light to be honest but they'll be able to see a little bit more at least a little bit more construction botched need defenses i know we need defenses but we haven't got any defenses at the moment pollution pump don't need that right now uh da, 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 lectern pew let's uh reliquary the hell is that light ball loudspeaker drum gibbet cage skull spike don't need any of those we'll do a ritual spot here because we're going to start getting some of the insect meat from one of our rituals and it should make people a lot happier we do need to make a zone though for you know what we should do just one more there one more door there I and mean, you guys need to like dig a hell of a lot quicker man we have moved everything out no we haven't we need you guys to we need all of you to do some more hauling man where's the hauling and we should do some floors with dwarves man we should be doing that let's get some of our production down uh, da, 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 da. stone cutters table let's get a stone cutters table down we'll stick you somewhere where you can't fit uh, of course you can't fit anywhere right now we'll stick you in the middle there just for the moment there's some light and stuff structure furniture we will clean up this stuff eventually still done in chair because we have no wood or what we have no wood let's just stick that down it's not going to be comfortable uh we will chop down some more trees here in a bit right so we got some nutrient setting up we need to set up as much as we can right now because we need a that food source growing he's gonna start thor is gonna start doing that our bearded ladies we had to have beards like we could not have beards it's dwarves i tried to i tried to look at some mods etc but i wasn't really that like there was there was a lot of things that would mess about and i wanted to keep it more vanilla experience we do have a visitor who's this his name blue magpie barra confederacy see what do you want low medicine why ah there's loads of medicine floating about though i did see some where are you we don't need it right now health uh i've forgotten where to go into medical care yeah but i want to set it all to having no medicine for the moment i can't remember how to do it uh peril reading policies drug policy whatever man uh it's just policies man where is it yeah i found it just default medicine settings all we're not going to use anything i'll manually do it if i need to but when it becomes a bit of a problem let us uh expand zone there we go you need to grow some more mushrooms there sir we've only got a couple more left and then we can start hauling those out and they'll start making some bricks we do need to get someone to clean though we'll eventually hopefully get some robots that'd be quite nice let's just fill that out there we go new lovers who we got thora and astrid thora and astrid arouse and agree to become thora's lover okay wait a second 
Astrid and Thora. Are you going to make us babies? Thora's a male? I thought Thora was a female. Ah, that messed up. I messed that up. Ah, well, at least we might have some babies soon. We need to make some double beds. We need to start cracking on with the bedrooms. Um, da, 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 da. What is that? Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that zone. We don't want you there. I pressed the wrong button. Growing zone. I just want the growing zone, man. There we go. Delete. Let's get this. Expand into there. Now we have all of it. Uh, you need to expand this a little bit more. What was that? Gift from Barrack and Ferdinand two crafting components thank you so much that's really nice of you breaking down tables and shit why are you just putting that stuff in there man have i got no space left to expand the zone a little bit get it all the way around there we got rid of the body as well so we don't get that um we won't have that issue later on for sure uh, why you keep putting those over here is there a zone in here that i didn't I accidentally did or what ah because he needs to grow so he's just moving out of the way now these guys are gonna move out of the way what have we got here we have a bill i did have a bill to create limestone blocks no that's a marble chunk. Ah, that's crap loads of marble. Okay, my bad. Limestone blocks, details, close. Add bill, add bill, 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 bill. It was marble, no? Marble's pretty as well, so it's actually going to be pretty good. Do until you have, do forever while we have it. While we have the space, we can get that cracked on. Details, we're going to make sure that whoever's doing it has got high enough so we're not always messing about with it. We do need to set up our simple research bench, but we need more space. But I want to be able to clear all this out first. What a mad squirrel jump to location. How far away are you? Right. Do, do, do. You have this. Let's just quickly go and mess you up. Come on, mad squirrel. What are you doing? Where are you going? Where's it going? I'm just going to punch him in the head a little bit. Bye bye. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Let's carry you prioritize hauling squirrel. Lovely. Just give me a little bonky bonks on the head and yes, that. What we should do is actually build this out so it's all the way out here. I think that would actually be a lot better for... You need to get deleted. I forgot about you. Structure, limestone, but we want marble. Marble door there. We do need to mine this out because it's got some metal there. Right, dig this out now. Orders, mine. We'll dig you out and we'll dig you out like that. Two, three, and five. Two, three, and five. Two, three. Did I miss up that no point one two and then cracking across i was like what the hell did i do wrong there doing a little bit of everything wrong to be honest like i'm not i haven't played this game enough to be like really like really really good at it like it's been a long time since i've played it so there's gonna be a lot of mistakes i made and i would love to hear any of your advice on what i should do and what i shouldn't do and if i'm screwing something up and also let me know how to sort this anomaly thing out can i wait for it or not is a big point a big question that i'm going to be having for this right let's dig out these two rooms and we're going to try and make some bedrooms off of these because <laughs> i'm going to try we'll do it this way so we'll go like this and like this like this up because they don't need a lot of space a lot of space isn't what they need so we can like just is that gonna be enough though you can have four by four bedroom and we'll just like start building them all the way around and we can have everyone have their little space because when i build inside i like to have it i'm kind of i have to have it symmetrical like i have to so if like caves turn up here it's gonna ruin my fucking day like completely so we'll just build it this way and we'll turn these into bedrooms we'll have some double beds going on in here for people if they start to become couples and stuff um we really need to i was a dog eating our meals <clears throat> excuse me i just choked myself to death we'll use this as a storage room so we will need to put some marble doors in here just dig it out lads and gents dig it out we should get an attack somewhere soon you know what i'm gonna do though i'm gonna uh, reinstall you in here so we can be inside because we can't i don't really want to be outside at all if we don't need to be so we really need to start working on these zones stockpile zones uh stockpile let's get you cracking on over here so this is gonna be a stockpile zone and we can get rid of this zone delete Boom. And then they should be able to just transfer that over. They'll start moving stuff once they dug it all out. We have some compacted machinery there. That's going to suck. Because then we'll have to build the walls around. Right. Here's an important thing. Since it looks like we'll be here for a while, Astrid thinks that you should give your faction a name and we should also name the local settlement. Now, we're going to have Karak and Kor and our faction name is going to be Durin's Folk, obviously, because I am literally about as creative as a goldfish. So there we go. Your faction is now known as Durin's Folk, and this community is now known as Karak and Kor, and it's going to be our giant crossway. We're we only going to have a little bit here. So eventually, I will actually just delete these walls so we have the single door. So anything that comes in will be attacking from this point. I think that's going to be the best bet for the moment, but we still need to get rid of all of this crap. So 
get rid of this and we also need to haul all of you and get rid of this stuff out of the way we'll do it a bit at a time so i'll wait until we've then moved all of this stuff out because we need to actually just haul all of this crap so this is all done now they'll start hauling and getting shit out of the way and we'll start moving our stuff inside and then we can get rid of this wall so we can also use this as a bit of a spot to go into um i am probably going to build like a quarry zone out of this way here so we're going to go down and we can have all of our blocks stored in here and we'll use that to craft within the base i want to have everything inside summer's turned up so it's going to be hot inside but winter is coming soon but we're okay because we have a it says need meal source we have a meal source man uh 70 percent grown but we need to actually i was just like having a special moment uh electric stove field stove let's do a field stove we'll have you cracking on inside we do need some food quick but we'll have a we'll have a food source when we do that we do need to cut down some more trees when we have a moment because we have zero wood we will put the let's Add bill, cook simple meal times four. We'll just do this until you have details. We'll do it until we have 15. Yeah, 15 will do. So now they can cook simple meals whenever it needs to be done. Do we have, who do we have that is a cook? Cooking zero. Cooking zero. Cooking zero. <laughs> cooking four. Brynhild can do some cooking. Ah, so can Thora. So Thora can be the person that jumps on the cooking. Let's go to work. Cooking, 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 cooking. Thora is the only one doing it. There we go. Sweet as but she's also doing the blocks for the marble so now we have all of this starting to move inside let's i think we should start to think about maybe cutting out some of the bedrooms we can go bop 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 and then i don't know what popped up on my screen there some automatic just oh here we go choke partners what have we got just one random ass dude uh are you gonna come straight away is he gonna attack straight away i didn't see if he was gonna attack straight away or not where are you going why are you attacking this is this mine ah that's why okay screw it come on lads let's go let's just get you around the corner come on he's over here just breaking down a giant thing that we can break down ourselves like oh shit we don't get too close to that i don't think let's try is it gonna back it down medical treatment needed tony's out right you guys can go back there's a club there though we're not going to be using that he's not even he just got up how did he get up why can't i clear go let's just fire at tony come on tony where are you going you're gonna die or what there we go thank you very much let's just get rid of you get you to pick that up and um do, do, do. why did you just leave that food on the floor everyone should be okay now i don't know who was damaged who was damaged no health conditions raise club on the head ah, he's all right he's all right was brynhild our doctor i've got no health conditions anyway we do need to set up those bedrooms so they can start getting the beds up. We'll put some marble doors in there. Because we can. Marble door, marble door. And then a marble door there. Is this messing with the awful barracks and sadly environment disturbed sleep? Yeah, we're going to move it all out in a second, guys. Don't worry. We'll get it sorted. We do need to actually get... I'm going into... I'm literally clicking into all of these. And then after that structure marble door here bang we'll put some marble doors in here as well because this area do we need let's expand this zone clear that all out we do need these guys to clear up at some point zone 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 furniture what did it say medical treatment needed still well we put that there that there we go around and go there we'll put you in here and here oh that's not in the right place i'm gonna i'm gonna be really upset with that one let's get rid of you cancel get rid of you furniture torch let's get you in there there we go that should give us a little bit of light we'll also do the same in here one two one and two one two we don't need any in that way but we'll put a little bit more light in here why not just so we have it i don't think we have enough to make those though we need some more wood so that's gonna be another thing we need to bloody do actually orders chop wood let's cut down some trees there's a lot of rain outside just wish we could make everything out of metal to be honest some more doors we will be able to get all the lights and stuff later on and we'll start cleaning up the floors and stuff what flooring do we have right now concrete paved tiles hmm it's gonna be more sciencey what was that something just popped up what was it medical treatment needed who needs medical treatment uh thora not assigned to doctor and is it you ah oh, crap that's why because she's the only person there who is the secondary doctor you over there thora come here you can prioritize tending let's go he's up anyway astrid healer is fully healed just forgot to do that we need to self-tend if you're gonna be able to do that man health health allow self-tend we need you guys to cut down some wood man don't give you too many bloody jobs we got low medicine uh do we want to grow some medicine i don't know if we're gonna wait there might be some medicine flowing about to be honest ancient giant wheels is this guy gonna like crack open one day and screw us up or what there's the anima tree we do need to soften up these walls as well and soften them up but we need to uh smooth walls well at least they're starting to make some fire now are these still growing growth rate 96 percent 33 percent grown i wonder if 
dark light gets it any better. It's taking a hell of a long time, but we still have quite a decent amount. We've only got 32 packaged meals. Holy crap. Uh, yeah. Why is the medicine outside? Why is there medicine outside? That's not okay. There's some wood there as well. I didn't even see that stuff. This stuff was all... Yeah, I screwed up that pretty bad, to be honest. Why didn't I see that stuff? Go pick up the crap. You need to pick up all that stuff because it's going to start breaking down, man. We need all of it. Come on, go grab it. We'll get some power soon and we can put some lights down, proper lights down. Do I have wall lights? Did they even add that yet? Wall lamp. They've added vanilla wall lamps. That is a beautiful thing. We need to build a place for our power cells and stuff like that. Let's uh, get some furniture. Let's put a double bed. Can you make a steel double bed? Steel royal bed. Uh, no, we want a steel double bed. Marble double bed. Why not? Let's see. <laughs> I'm going to break some people's backs for sure. Let's see if they actually crafted down. Everything's on sped up. Actually, what we need to do is still build a couple more doors here. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Then you guys need to move your crap out. We've got everything now at least. But this fungus is not growing quickly at all. Does it go up with the growth? Hmm. Yeah, I don't even remember. Fungus dark torch. I oh, know that caught that's just causes fungus. Uh, tree braze eliminates surrounding with dark light, creates heat. These satisfy royal brazer requirements. Uh, dark torch. Dim light over a large area people who prefer dark light work best for this light can be automatically refueled with wood produces a small amount of heat nah see that's not what we need i'm pretty sure it just grows it just grows really slowly they're gonna be really upset if i start growing some rice to be honest where's this uh there's nowhere near the entrance that we can have to grow some over here but it's just not good enough man what's that it's a random ass tree just sitting there right we'll try to make this as dwarvy as possible i kind of want a throne room in this entrance way over here and we can build out more from here and we'll have a, like a centralized circle over here because we're gonna have some more bedrooms put in place is there enough we aren't making enough of those marbles but at least everyone's got some beds now i'm kind of overbuilding stuff though i think that's going to be a problem for me at the moment let's try and we'll go in floors and we'll make some concrete here for the moment let's just bang these out get this all concreted out just to have a little bit of a better floor you know it's not going to be beautiful or anything but it's gonna be okay i think just for the moment you know without having these dirty floors we do need to get some robots there's a big thing we need right now let's just do that okay and we can just literally go across this whole thing down here there we go so they're building more beds and we can break these other beds down so we got three down there's a couple so we can get rid of two guys i'm gonna use a lot of steel for this but it's gonna be we're digging out the mountain there'll be a lot of steel and if not we'll have to find some from somewhere it shouldn't be too bad we definitely need some people to clean though mm. construction boxed you you messed up bolt goods trader Jump to location. What are you going to have? Who's the social? Who's my social boy? You are. Dora. You're a little, little bit of everything, aren't you? Trade with Henrietta. Let's see what you got for me. Right. What can we sell? We've got components. We've got steel. We've got packaged survival meals. We do need to buy some beer. We can turn people into alcoholics. I wish I didn't mess that up. Ceremonial hoods. We need to start crafting stuff as well. That's another thing. They're not willing to buy. I was hoping they'd buy some of that medicine, maybe. We haven't got anything right now we could make some meat what we'll do is actually oh god screwed up again it's all right it's all right what we got over here we still haven't broke oh we have broke all this down now at least it's gonna look a little better all the beds are there let's get rid of these beds delete 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 after they finish that i'll have a little rest and they'll be finished with that all right everyone started to they just woke up they got all started to get their stuff but we did buy some meat because we need to make some reservation with a fleeing knight i don't want to accept it at all how do i drop that shit bin get out of my face don't want to do anything to do with the royalty stuff i think that's the royalty stuff anyway it's been too damn long uh let's get some more light going in furniture wall lamps let's get you there get you there get you there and then we should be able to just just for like the time being get some lamps in these corridors so everyone's not like even though they got dark vision i kind of want there to be a little bit of light in these places so i can see it's for my own personal uh, it's kind of selfish really but it is what it is we pick up these Oh my god. Astrid. Prioritize hauling those, man. Get them out of the darkness. How many is there? 25. And it's not 34. Come on. Get the hell out of there. Get it inside so it's not being attacked. Also, while you're there, prioritize heal caribou meat. Some other people are eating it, probably. What's that? Bed is no longer assigned to Colgrim, obviously. This is loads of beds, man. Just pick a bed. Pick whatever bed you want. All right, now they should start. Let's get this mined out. And what we'll do, actually. Hmm. Rejected proposal. Thor and Astrid. <laughs> Rejected proposal. It's too much for the relationship to continue and the two have now broken up. Thank you so much. Oh. Why are you going to be so upset, man? Night owl in the daytime. Oh, so are your day shift. 
Let's sort out. I'm, t I'm telling him to sort out his own bloody schedule. So, Colgrim, you need to be. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You need to be. I don't know. Sleep at these times. And then you can do anything in these times. Because you are a night owl. You need to get that stuff sorted. I will go through and I'll sort out all of those kind of things as well. Like, it's not just. I'm not just ignoring it. I do know that I have to do certain things, especially with that. We need to start having some babies soon, man. That's going to be something that needs to be done if we're going to survive. How many? We got six food left. Why have we got eight? Did I make some... Did we make meals? We did make some meals. Not a lot, though. I used a lot of that meat. I really messed up by only making... We're at 53% grown, but they should get started soon. We have some stuff we can... There's a wolf there. I don't think we should hunt that, to be honest. We've got some of these. Let's hunt these bad boys down. Who's our two gun guys? All right, gun, gun. Okay, you two. We need you to come out here and go and hunt. There's something that's died there. We need to just grab that and take his meat back, at least for the time being. All right, you two need to... No wrong one you hunt this guy you hunt this guy are they dead did they get away okay you need to haul this guy back what do you mean just haul it back man why is it just consume why can't you god damn it zone dumping stop power zone mm -mm -mm -mm. just here for the bodies storage uh clear all corpses animal corpses only and we'll put you as important and we'll put this structure production butcher's table will have you there so you can be right in there and hopefully that fixes it can you pick these up can you prioritize hold an ibex ram okay you're already doing it let's get this going are you gonna kill that ibex ram or what i don't know you're firing from a really long way away man let's just prioritize holding that dude go right butcher's table can be crafted now they're gonna be eating we, we haven't got much food left i'm gonna die of starvation because i was not paying attention all right bills add bill butcher creature do for Forever after. Boom. Did someone get in there and do that? Who's gonna be who's our cook? Who was our cook? Cook, 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 cook. Cause Thora. Thora's literally everything. Literally everything. Uh prioritize butchering at a wooden table. Okay. Prioritize butchering. And then we need you to cook. Don't go to bed. We need you to cook. Prioritize cooking at fuel stove. Go. Cook everything. We need the meals, man. You can sleep afterwards. Sleep when we're dead. I think that's a decent amount of meat. So we can get at least a decent amount of meals that's gonna let us go. And hopefully this is grown soon. It's only 53%, man. Jesus. Maybe I'm just remembering it wrong. There's a lot of chunks out there, which is why we can't get the chunks out of people's rooms and shit. Right. I'm waiting for... We got low food. We need to fix that. We need to fix that quickly. Where are you going, Astrid? What are you... There's a dead dude. She's pissed off. She's seen him dead now. Astrid, what are you doing all the way over there? Going for a walk. That's not a walk, man. That's a hell of a long way away. Now we have this room. We should probably stick down our... Um, we'll put this down as a steel one, as a research bench. We'll get that down in there um it's raining a lot what else do we need because there's an electric smelter but we can't use that just yet Who's, what's dying what's dying Who's, where's our dog dead where's our dog oh that bear is fucking up that wolf man that bear needs to stay the hell away from my dog dog you need to stay regina what are you doing here i didn't even know we had a dog i forgot that was a random animal right research let's go into research what we got uh oh god i forgot how really ridiculously bad that is mm -mm -mm. Right, so where are we going? We need to start making smithing. We can start making weapons for the old Smithy Gladius, but we're not going to use any of that. We're going to be using only... So there's a mace at least there. Because we need to start going in to start making the frag grenades and stuff. And that's going to be really important. Gunsmithing and flak armor will be really important for us here soon. We already have electricity, it looks like. It's finished. Air conditioning. We have a cooler already. So we can literally just start making... Oof, we've got some stuff unlocked that I didn't even realize we have unlocked. To be honest, floodlight, geothermal power. Mm. I think I'm going to research that first just to have the power instantly. I think I'm just going to get that done first. Right. We're actually starting to sweep up. You're cleaning up the house, boys. Good job. You definitely need to start. Thora, prioritize butchering. Minor break risk. Who? Colgrim. What do you need? Night owl, bed. Night owl in daytime. Yeah, because I just set you to go to bed, man. Where's your schedule at? It's rotted away in storage because we haven't created a freezer. I'm messing up so much. It's been so damn long. Uh, New lovers. Who is it? Astridge and Thora again. Okay. They're just getting back together. No one else is getting together, though. That's kind of weird. I'm going to sort out our work priorities. So what we got here? Manual priorities. Oh, God. That, I remember how bad that is. So we'll do everyone a firefight. Why can't you fire? Firefight, Astrid. Disabled by medical assistant backstory. Why not? So we'll do that. Everyone's going to be patient. How do I do that and set it all at the same time? 
I've forgotten how to do that shit. We'll just do it manually for now. Uh, doctor, boom, doctor, boom. Okay, bed rest. Childcare, don't really care about these. You're all red. Uh, let's get you rid of those. Why has everyone got fire in bloody childcare? Basic, warden. Don't need that for now. Handle, cook. Your priority is to cook. Um, your priority is to grow. We'll stick everyone on two on mining so we get that done quickly in construction. We'll get that going first. Everything else is kind of just like non really existent. But we do need Astrid to jump on that because there's nothing else you're really doing apart from Doctor. What are you doing over here? Like, what is your job? Your job is to construct and mine. So we'll get you to clean and haul. That's going to be your job. Uh, Thora, Brynhild, who was the engineer? You're the engineer, so we can put you crafting up a little bit and that should be everything sorted. Hauling and cleaning for that guy. Sweet as. It's going to be okay for now. We got that sorted. And I think I'm going to put a cut in there for that episode. We're sitting at about an hour mark. I'm probably going to cut it up a little bit so it isn't so like all over the place. Um, but I want to thank you all for watching. Remember to like and sub if you haven't already for all your survival gaming goodness and remote goodness because I'm going to be doing a little series on this for now with the dwarves. I hope you enjoyed it. Fly safe and avoid like a chat scams.